Sometimes when you're going on vacation, it might be best just to leave the animals alone. From wild safaris in Africa to some oceans of your favorite beaches, here are the most dangerous tourist attractions with dangerous animals. Number 13. Everglade Alligator Farms Everglades National Park is one big swamp full of alligators. But if that wasn't already enough, they also have alligator farms here too. Over 2,000 alligators live on the farm alone and another 200,000 live in the Everglades. With tourists coming to town wanting to check out some dangerous animals, you know there are going to be some wild incidents. Gators are very crafty creatures and if you ask someone who lives near the Everglades, you'll be surprised how they can often climb fences and get into pools. Some have even been known to jump up on the fan boats that are passing through. People swimming in lakes in the area have often fallen victim to dangerous alligators over 12 feet long in recent years. Number 12. Half Dome Yosemite This massive granite dome is found on the eastern end of Yosemite and it looks like some giant just chopped a mountain in half. There have been many daring attempts to conquer this peak of the Half Dome since 1875, which rises 4,737 feet above the valley floor. It's a little bit easier now with the installation of cable routes, but it's still a challenge nonetheless. If it didn't seem challenging enough, Yosemite is also home to dangerous animals such as bears, mountain lions, bats, and bighorn sheep. These might choose to attack you at any moment. The peak is known to attract lightning strikes, so hikers need to be aware of weather conditions before climbing up this strange geological formation. Many people might underestimate the amount of strength it takes to walk up this thing. And if it starts to rain while you're on here, you might be in serious trouble. Number 11. Bali, Indonesia. Venomous snakes are quite common in subtropical countries, which can certainly put a damper on your plans. If you ever plan a trip to India, you better plan on bringing some anti-venom with you because there's an average of 15,000 lethal venomous snake bites each year. Maybe they should just stop trying to charm them? Indonesia is home to the famous getaway known as Bali, and it came in at number two with 11,000 lethal snake bites each year. Bali has 35 species of different snakes, including the king cobra, spitting cobra, and their oceans contain the most lethal snake of all time, the sea snake. This has no anti-venom at all, and once you get bit, be ready to meet your maker. Number 10. Gonsby, South Africa. If you're frightened by sharks, this is certainly the creepiest place on Earth. Also known as Shark Alley, this area doesn't get its name for nothing and it's located in South Africa. It's known for its extremely dense population of great white sharks and it manages to attract a large number of tourists each year. But that doesn't mean they should be swimming in the oceans. There have also been a large number of shipwrecks in this area because of the rocky beaches and low visibility. Daring marine scientists hoping to get a safe up close look at the sharks here will be lowered down in the shark cages and witness the massive beasts. It's possible that the sharks like this area because of the high population of Cape fur seals living on nearby Geyser Rock. Number 9. The Jersey Shore We're all familiar with the Jersey Shore from television, but there was a period of time when this was one of the most feared tourist attractions on the East Coast. Some horrible things were lurking around the shore, and we're not talking about Snooki. In 1916, an extreme heat wave drove many out to the beach to enjoy a fresh dip in the ocean. Sharks normally prefer warm climates to the south, but due to the heat wave, they made it up to the north. If only the people here had known what was lurking beneath. Five people were attacked in an 11-day time period. This sparked a war against sharks in this area, and people were sent to hunt them down. This was also one of the largest animal hunts in history. We're pretty sure Polly D would have punched a few of those in the nose if he had the chance. Number 8. Yellowstone Yellowstone National Park is considered to be the first national park in the U.S. and was signed into effect in 1872 by Ulysses S. Grant. At the size of 3,471 square miles, this is larger than the states of Delaware and Rhode Island combined. Now it attracts 3 million visitors each year. Yellowstone is certainly no stranger to bears, and a total of 8 related bear fatalities make it the second most dangerous park in the U.S. when it comes to bears. Since 1980, there have been 38 reported injuries as well. Yellowstone is located in three different states, including Idaho, Wyoming, and Montana. The amazing wildlife here that makes themselves home includes buffalo, wolves, elk, and certainly bears. The buffalo here might be herbivores, but people certainly gotta watch out when they start to stampede. Don't get too scared though, you're still more likely to drown in one of their lakes than actually get attacked by one of the bears. Just be careful about where you leave your food. Number 7. Crocodile wrestlers. While most people would run away in pure fright if they ever came across one of these beasts, people in the Ukraine stick their heads between their mouths. Circus performers here push it to the absolute max by pulling off these death-defying stunts. This guy really seems to have a thing for this crocodile, giving it a kiss on his forehead. Are we sure this guy isn't from Australia? Number 6. 
The Amazon River. If parasites that swim up your urethra aren't enough to scare you off, maybe the piranhas will. The Amazon is certainly one of the most notorious bodies of water in the world, and it's a place you should never swim. There are parts of the Amazon where you'll find nothing but piranhas, because they sort of just kind of ate everything. There's also a type of scavenger catfish, which can basically tunnel its way inside of what it's eating with its razor sharp teeth and then eat you from the inside out. There are just a slew of animals here that would enjoy nothing else but inflicting all kinds of harm on you, so don't take that chance. Number 5. African Safaris Near Johannesburg, South Africa, some dumb tourists on a safari thought it'd be fun to see how far they can push a limit with some lions nearby. The incident was captured on camera of some of the tourists honking their horns and hoping to make the lions react in some way. The lion basically got fed up with being treated like that and jumped up next to the car and started scratching the windows. The tourist allegedly forgot to close the window and the lion was able to stick its paw into the automobile. Just leave the animals alone, people. Number 4. Stingray Wants to Play Possibly one of the best photo bombs of all time, these three women were vacationing in the Cayman Islands and decided to take a photo. The stingray also decided it wanted to be a part of the photo and was tired of always being left out, so he lurched out of the sea and landed on their backs. The one in the middle seems to be in sheer terror of the whole situation. Some claim that it's actually not a random photo and people here actually pay to go to stingray reserves and get a photo with one. Number 3. Japan's West Coast Japan might not be exactly known for its beach tourism, but that's most likely because they got swarmed by massive radioactive jellyfish. These are typically found along the west coast of Japan in the Sea of Japan. This is one of the world's most productive bodies of water when it comes to finding fish for consumption. It accounted for 5% of the world's global fish catch in 2009. However, in recent years, it seems as though it's the easiest thing for fishermen here to catch. Although some jellyfish can be made into some type of food once dried, they're not a really valuable commodity and sting swimmers. Many claim this is due to the temperature of the sea rising in recent years, most likely coming from pollution in China. Number 2. Chow Patty Beach, India. Who knew cows could be dangerous enough to make our list? Well, nothing in India should surprise you anymore. Chow Patty Beach, located in Mumbai, has amazing sunsets and is a beautiful beach if you can get over the fact that it's one of the most polluted in the world. The water is heavily polluted and it's not recommended that people actually swim here. Fecal coliform levels, which is a bacteria that comes from sewage, animals, and agriculture, was through the roof here, much higher than the safe limit. The beach is noted for its Hindu festivals, where many people go swimming. In 2011, about 60,000 metric tons of coal was dumped near the beach and severely polluted it. Many won't come here anymore due to the horrific stench. Probably best for you not to bring a first date for a romantic walk on the beach here, despite the amazing sunsets. And number one. Glacier National Park This national park, located in the state of Montana, takes up 1,583 square miles and is one of the most scenic national parks in the U.S. Seeing photos of this place will certainly make you want to come here. It's also the national park with the most bear attacks. If you camp here, just be careful, there's roughly 300 grizzly bears that live in the park. Although 12 bear-related fatalities might not seem like a whole lot here, that's still a 50% increase from second place Yellowstone. What's strange, though, is that the number of bear attacks does seem to be a little bit on the rise in North America within the past few decades, as people continue to venture off further into their territory. 